You're listening to the Wake Up Wealthy Podcast, the only podcast that helps you turn pro in mind, body, spirit, and business. You know, to be quite honest, it's probably still doing the same thing, you know? And, and I think we, it, we as entrepreneurs, we, especially now that you're about to have a little baby, you have to make that decision as well, you know? The way I'm seeing it is that social media is a tool, and it's, going to, it's a tool I'm going to use to help mm-hmm. build my empire. Outside of that, I don't give a damn if I'm famous anymore. I don't care about any of that stuff because, quite honestly, um, that's not going to get me paid. It's not going to get me paid. It's not going to get me paid. It's not going to help my family. It's not going to help my children, and that's my priority. Facts. Facts. I love that. I love that because, I mean, it's true. And right now, like, okay, so if you were able to give advice to an 18 to 25-year-old who – thinks that they want to be like a social media entrepreneur right now. It, it's, this is the yeah, sexy. I'll tell, flat out. I'll tell you flat out. Stop faking the funk. You haven't made any money yet. You haven't proven anything to the world. You ain't worth shit, to be quite honest with you. Your ego is what's driving you to be famous on social media. Go actually build something. Go actually prove that you can make money. Go actually prove that you're worth a salt. And then share your story with people. I think people are completely doing the opposite. I'm a, sometimes you're a part of these comment pods and I'm like, dude, you don't make no money. 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 Like, like, am I the only one that makes money here? And I'm out. I bounce. I can't even handle it because people are just, <laughs> no, people are just faking the funk. They're quite dude, honest. It, it's so true. And, you, and the thing is now that people don't understand, like when they start to, is people can sit through the bullshit. Like I don't like me, for example, I don't hop on Instagram and tell you how to run an eight figure business. Because guess what? I don't run you an eight-figure eight business. Right? Right. I haven't built an eight-figure business. And like I'm just like I share, and this is what people need to understand as well. Like, if they do want to share content, like share the process. That's what resonates with people, anyways. Like seeing an individual who's like, Yeah, I've got a fucking Lamborghini and make 25 million a year. Like, that's not Hold relatable. On. Hold on. There's another thing. Another thing is on top of the fact that you're not creating wealth, then you go on, you buy a liability to fake the funk even more and it puts you even more in debt, that's called idiocracy or stupidity or whatever the hell you want to call it. And that's what people are doing right now. Right, right. And it is all because of this idea of attention. But what they don't understand is, I mean, we have, it's such an unknown. Like we have no idea what Instagram, it changes daily. We don't know what it's going to be in five years. And you know, what's a sure thing is like investing in yourself, investing in your business, learning your, learning your skill set and mastering it yep absolutely absolutely that's what it's all about build wealth through assets and the number one asset is you